you currently feel overwhelmed with your loan obligation? Or maybe flustered at even the thought of taking a facility? Well, we made this video for you. Today, we're talking about managing your loan obligations properly. My name is Oinge. Welcome to More with Sikamo. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Also, click the notification bell to get amazing videos just like this one. Sikamo. Keeping good communications with your lender or financial institution is a very important part in developing that relationship. In fact, when times get challenging and maybe you miss a repayment, going quiet is probably the worst thing that you can do. The best thing you can do is to pick up a phone or send an email or at least respond when they're trying to contact you. Not only is it good to keep that relationship, but another reason would be if they do decide to report to the credit bureaus, that could damage your credit history. Um, and obviously that would affect you from taking loans in the future. So do the right thing, pick up a phone, send an email, communicate and enjoy your relationships. Also ensure that your monthly repayment is not more than one third of your total cash flow so that it's not be difficult for you to make repayments every month. You know what can be cumbersome? Managing separate loans with separate tenures and separate interest rates. What you want to do is merge all of them into one consolidated loan. That way you have one interest rate one tenure and one repayment amount that helps you manage your debts properly. I hope this helps. One of the ways you could manage your debts is checking the terms and conditions carefully. There are four things you need to have in mind when going through your contract. First, are there any benefits to paying your loan early? Secondly, what are the hidden charges or fees associated with taking the loan? You want to check for that because those things can be hidden. Thirdly, what are the basis um, of the loan? Is it a flat basis or is it reducing balance? You also want to make sure that you understand that very carefully. Lastly, all these three terms I've spoken about, are they negotiable? Can you talk to your lender about making them more favorable for you? If you can, please discuss to your lender. Also, as a salary earner, we advise that you tie your loan repayment to a steady income. And if you're a business um, owner, try to understand your cash inflow. And of course, if you are able to maintain this, it will uh, help you to better manage your finances and also um, your indebtedness to any institution. Thank you. Well, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to watch our other amazing videos in this link above. Thank you.